Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. This is Eric, Eric Mobley, your independent sensing consultant. So um, I'm coming at you today with a July haul. Um, we recently had some things come in and um, I'm super excited to share them with you. Um, I know I've had these for a little bit, but um, I am excited to kind of share some reviews and also let you know my thoughts on some products. So I'm just gonna jump right in. So first we have uh, washer whiffs in the Fiji flower. So if you haven't tried the washer whiffs, they essentially go in your washer drum and they boost, uh, they add like a boost of fragrance to your clothes, towels, blankets. Um, they're, they're really good for towels and blankets. Um, I don't typically, I'm just being honest, I don't typically smell like a lingering smell when I wash my clothes, but I still do use these on my clothes. Only thing I don't use these on is my comforter and that is because they tend to not really break down as easily. Like they do a pretty good job with anything else. Um, but you know, your comforter is thick typically and I just choose not to uh, use these when I wash my comforter for my bedroom. So um, really great on towels and towels as well as blankets. So. Um, and this, it doesn't have the scent description, but Fiji Flower is a very like soft floral scent. It's not like in your face floral, not like what I call grandma floral or like funeral home where it's like a super strong, like headache inducing floral. It's very light. I really like this one a lot. This is, I don't know, more like a beachy flower, if you will. I mean, it says Fiji, so. Um, this actually was a scent that was in the summer collection a couple of years ago and since he brought it back in the catalog full time. So I was super excited about this and it is one of my favorites. So got the Fiji Flower Washer Whiffs and I'm not going to go through all of these but a crap ton of scent circles and car bars. Spoiler alert, as a consultant I have like my own parties a lot where customers just order if they have a ra random order to place i'll have them go to you know a party that i'm kind of hosting at the time which is like july orders or no party order here and it's just a really great way for consultants to you know get the best of their get the best bang for your buck and oh i have a little visitor this is ellie she's back she's so sweet um she knows I'm not paying attention to her, <laughs> so. Um, but this is really awesome. Um, the party rewards are really great because uh, we're able to get our own like free and half price products. So um, one thing that I got was a bunch of scent circles. I really like to use the, like I use them myself and so does my husband, um, but I really like to give these away as gifts to customers because I'm, I just really appreciate them. So um, I try to keep those in stock. And I also have car bars, so really excited to restock those. And I like various scents, so just take that as you will. There's not a lot of like repeat scents or anything. And then I have the Counter Clean in uh, Scarlet Sunflower. This stuff is like magic in a bottle, as a lot of consultants say. Um, and then like this, this scent itself is fantastic. It's like a it doesn't smell floral even though it's scarlet sunflower. It's like an apple, it's like an apple and floral, apple and sunflowers, I guess. And like, I don't know, I kind of get a little bit of pear from it too. It's one of my favorite scents ever. The bar of this is actually in my Scentsy Club. So um, the counter clean is wonderful, obviously for your counters, but I also use them like on my stove top and I've used them on my car a lot. So literally it's amazing. Like. I'll just spray a little bit on a cloth and you can clean like the inside of your car. I've even cleaned the outside of my car a little bit if it has like dust or dirt or something. It's really, really wonderful that for that and it smells good. Um, also, uh, it's great for getting out like stains in your carpet or if you have pets, like pet stains or what have you. Um, I know I recently cleaned our carpets pretty thoroughly and um, I just sprayed kind of like carpet foaming cleaner but I also sprayed this down and it helped a lot so that's just that's not coming from the company but that's just something that I do personally and I really really like uh, the counter clean so 
that is something else I got. And I, I try to keep that pretty stocked up. Um, and also, I uh, got a bunch of pods. So if you are not aware, Scentsy Pods are what goes in our wall fan, uh, our fan diffuser systems. So we have a wall fan, a mini fan diffuser. Uh, our air purifier uses the pods. Um, we have a Scentsy Go and a tabletop fan diffuser. And essentially those don't use wax, they use these. And this is really nice because it's like no mess. It's these pl plastic cages essentially, essentially, and they have um, little fragrance beads in them. And each bead, each bead, each uh, pod lasts 60 hours. So um, I typically change out my pods like once or twice a week, depending on what I'm doing and if I remember to change them, but I try to change them at least every two weeks. Um, I really like these in large bathrooms and on low plugs. I don't like mini warmers on low plugs. If I do put a mini warmer on a low plug, I don't put wax in it. It's simply for decoration. Like I have like Halloween and Christmas ones that I will literally just, they're just decorative. I don't put wax in them. I don't want somebody to bump them and like, you know, spill the wax everywhere. So that's why I love the fan diffusers. So I got Blue Grotto. This is a really good citrus scent and it's like really growing on me. So I really like this one. Um, Luna, this is a really popular floral scent. Very soft floral, it's pretty fantastic. And Happy Go Lucky, this is actually only available in July. So if you're interested in something like this, it's really amazing. It's also like a soft floral, kind of a perfumey smell, but I really like it. And then Dark Harbor. Oh, and I have another one too. It's a really good woodsy, oh my gosh, that's fantastic. It's a good woods, like cologne type scent, if you like that sort of thing. And then Shaka. I'm currently warming the wax bar of this in my office and it's amazing. To me, it literally smells like I just walked into Abercrombie and Fitch, which I never shopped there when I was a teenager or even now, like, um, I know our local mall that had Abercrombie and Fitch and actually, um, that store closed, um, quite a while ago, actually, like almost 10 years ago. So it is no longer there, but I never shopped there, but I liked going in there because it smelled good. And my husband used that cologne when we first started dating. So I really like it. All right, also got some body wash. Got a body wash in Mystery Man and Glacier Water. These both are like really good woodsy masculine scents. This is kind of in the fresh category, but to me it does have a um, woodsy note to it because it has bergamot, driftwood, and lavender in it. It's really good. And then um, Mystery Man is really popular. It's white cedar, green verbena, and bergamot. So these are excellent. I love the body washes. They lather really well. Um, they have sunflower oil in them, I believe. So they're not, they don't, they won't like dry your skin out or anything like that. It's, yeah, pretty great. I don't, yeah, sunflower oil. Yeah, pretty great. All right. And then, in addition to the um, washer whiffs, I got some of the dryer discs. So these go in your dryer and they're good for about 75 loads. Um, and you get two in here. So it's a pack of two for $7. And they essentially are an, just even more of an extra boost for your uh, laundry, any type of laundry, your clothes, blankets, towels, anything like that. So. Um, these are pretty great. So I got Fiji Flower, Wildflower Cotton, which is, a, to me, it's a woodsy floral. Um, it smells kind of cologne -y to me, which is very interesting, but I like it. I just got done with the Scentsy Fresh of it, which is Scentsy's version of Febreze, and I really enjoy it. And Luna, of course. So I really like Luna a lot. And then I got more of the Body Wipes. So I did a whole video on these. Um, I'll try to put the link in the comments below. Uh, if not, you can always go to my playlist. Um, but these are fantastic. They're just, 
say you get home from the gym or you've been walking or whatever and you just want like a quick quick freshen up and you can use these to freshen up or you can keep these in your car in your purse anything like that just to kind of wipe off they're pretty fantastic so and they smell amazing well actually i don't want to open this one because i have one open already but um i just wanted to restock on these while they were still in stock i'm not sure if they're sold out i can check on that real quick i kind of want to <laughs> i'm very curious because a lot of these summer collection items have sold out which is no surprise but i do want to check on that real quick no, they're still available. They're $10 and you get 25 wipes. They're, and they smell fantastic. It looks like the only thing that's sold out um, from the summer collection is the turtle warmer, which was uh, Aloha Spirit, that was, that's what it was called. Um, and that doesn't surprise me either. People love turtles, it's summertime. Um, I know I sold at least one of those. So um, yeah, that was really popular. And then lastly, I have a handful of wax bars. So um, a few of these I actually did a review on, um, but I'm going to share with you what they are. All right, so um, I got blueberry cheesecake. Just as it, it smells like it sounds, it's just a sweet blueberry and you get like a hint of like cream cheese, I guess, like it's, I really like this one. It's good in the kitchen, of course. I don't really like it anywhere else, but it does smell very good. Coconut daiquiri. This is good. I smelled this in my Bring Back My Bar video. Just a good, like, coconut banana scent. I really, really like it. Lemon sorbet. Oh, it's... This is more... It smells like... All right. To me, this kind of smells like lemon heads or maybe a frozen lemonade from the county fair or something like that. It's just a good tart, but kind of sweet lemon scent. And I really like it. So that is lemon sorbet. And I did a whole video on the lavender scents, but this was included. These were included in this haul. So I'm gonna explain my thoughts kind of quickly about these. French lavender. To me, this is like a soft lavender, like almost like a perfume or cologne. Yeah, it's, it honestly smells kind of cologne-y to me. Um, I would still only warm this maybe in like a bedroom or a bathroom. Um, I think this would give me a headache if I warmed it in like an open concept, so. That's just me. It's not my favorite, but I do, I don't mind it. So that's French lavender. This one is whipped vanilla lavender. This one is lighter in my opinion because it has the sweetness of the vanilla in there. I would love this as like a body lotion. I know at one time we did have a hand cream in this and I think I used the last of them up like last year sometime so it was in the mother's day collection i think last year so it's really good light soft it's a good one so that's whipped lavender vanilla i would maybe warm this in like a living room but otherwise this would stay in a bedroom or bathroom for me and mystery man i know i already kind of talked about this one but it's just your classic this has been around forever. I remember when I had my first Scentsy party and I smelled this one, I was like, oh my gosh. And it, it smells really good in like a bedroom. And um, I, I like woodsy cologne type scents in the bedroom, like for sure. Um, and sometimes in the living room. It's really, really good, I love it. This used to be in the body care, but it's no longer available in the body care, but I still love it. Or wait. Yes, it is. What well, I'm crazy. Like, and it's still, I just had the um, body wash. So yes, it is still available on the body care, duh. So. But I just wanted to share my little uh, July haul with you guys. Do you use any of these products? Are you excited for anything that's coming up? Um, share with me your thoughts and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye guys.